What's up, guys? I can't do it. But, uh, hey, welcome back to this vlog. I mean, look, to the vlog. I really don't do vlogs often, but I'm going to try to do the best I can to post every day of, um, about vlogs, and uh, I'm just gonna be playing a game while I just talk about things. I usually talk about things that just goes on today. I don't talk about things that goes on in the past, besides divorces. No, I'm too young to get married. But, um, anyway, why am I going? I'm going to the wrong course, but, um, today, today was a decent day. I got a lot of stuff done. I mostly we just watched, I watched movies in a couple classes. Um, language arts class, we watched, I don't know what the movie was called, but, um, yeah, it was pretty good. Um, Ms. Vaughn had the choice of, like, if you wanted to work on Learning Farm, you would have to go in the back, like, back of the room and not watch the movie. No one decided to do Learning Farm because, screw work! My controller disconnected. Continue. But, screw home! But screw homework, everyone just wanted to do well, watch the movie. So we watched the movie for like a full hour or so. It doesn't work. In science class, we also watched a movie or something. Alright. I'm just gonna explain while I play the game because I think it's more better, but um Yeah, basically in science class we watched a movie. But, but during science class while we were watching a movie, the announcements came on and said the track is not a Glen Oak. I, I don't care that I reveal information of where I go. Screw it. If you want to find me, go ahead and fight me, bitch. Um but yeah, it's like it was like at 150 or something, and so they called. They were on the announcement saying that track is not at Glen Oak today. It was it was just at Oakwood, the school that I, that I was at. I don't know why. I mean, I don't know why they just permanently canceled um track. I mean, I was. I mean, during track, I was I was actually inside the whole time. We didn't do anything outside, but I actually missed the warm up because I was at science club until four o'clock because I'm at, I have a competition that's going on on Saturday. I had to leave at like six o'clock. Like, jeez, jeez, please. I had to be, I had to be there at eight o'clock. Actually, seven forty-five because I want to get there early enough. But um, yeah, I helped out science club until four. Until, yeah, until four. Then I went into track. I was wondering where everyone was at. I mean, I actually um, was able to find everyone. We, I, I lied. We were outside. We were doing a couple. We were doing a couple like sprints, like thirty-five meter sprints. I was pretty. I mean, I'd say I was average or something. I wasn't in the first place at all. I'm not the fastest sprinter, but um, I'd say I'm a pretty decent sprinter. I guess or something. I I failed. So yeah, we done that. And then we um, everyone was going inside for some reason. I was wondering why, because I thought because I I thought after the warm up we would usually do like like other sprints or other um distance activities or something. But no, we just went inside because everyone seemed to be getting their uniforms. Like wait, what? I thought it was like the 22nd we get, um, what was it, the 21st? I thought it was like the 22nd we get our uniforms or something, and, and, um, yeah, so what was, what was that, what was that doing? Oh, yeah, so, uh, as I was saying, like, during the announcements, they were saying, well, yeah, I literally, um, there were three people in my science class that went to track. John heard it, but he didn't do anything about it. I mean, he wasn't really, because after the announcements, I asked um, it was like me and Owen, that well, he's in the same science class as me, and um, apparently we both asked at the same time we can make a phone call. I allowed Owen to go first. He never says thanks to me, and of course he had to say he just he, he said thank you, and I said you're welcome with a pleasant, please, you're welcome. So I let him go first. He took like six minutes or something. So after he was done, I I, I swear, once he walked in the door, I'm like ah, oh, I'm making that phone call. So I walked down to the office. Asked to use the phone. Of course, they let me use the phone. Um, oh, my friend Kylie texted me as I'm making a vlog. Kylie, I'm doing a vlog right now. Do you mind? I'm trying. I'm gonna do this every day, guys. So hope you guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. If you don't want me to do this, just say fuck off. <laughs> just say I personally don't want you to do vlogs. Just do geometry dash or, or something helpful with your life or something. But anyway. So I, I went to call my dad. I called three times. He didn't answer. And so someone went in and said, if he's not answering, just leave a voicemail. I'm like, fine, I'll leave a voicemail. So I had to call him again. Luckily, he, well, he didn't answer. So I had to um leave him a voicemail saying, hi, uh, uh, track is uh, at Oakwood. Because Gina was the one that was 
was picking me up from the track. So Dad let her know. And I was thinking she was going to be at Oakwood because I thought she would be dumb enough to just go to Oak. Uh, not, not Oakwood, Glen Oak. Yeah, that's what I was saying. And, I, and um, while we were getting uniforms, I had to sit at my lock. No, not 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 my locker. I had to. We were sitting. We were standing in the eighth grade hallway, which um, I've never gotten cl that close to the eighth grade hallway. I got to see like the other classrooms. Mr. Dunk. It was actually uh, Mr. Dunk. It was his first year working at um. Oakwood. I saw him, like Miss Miss McGurla or something. Uh, there was Mr. Roberts. World languages. I went. I was able to. I walked in world languages, and there was like. <laughs> Literally everything that I saw was in a different language. I I I didn't really see one thing that I saw that was English. Like, does that class even English, bro? I mean, doesn't because it's called world languages. And so I asked a seventh grader, "What the heck, world languages?" He says, "He says, yeah, I take international Spanish." Bro, you're a seventh grader. That's in an eighth grade hallway, and you're telling me you do international Spanish. And bro, that dude that said that to me, his teeth, holy shit. And his glasses, oh my god. Where'd you get those glasses, like, from a farm? You bought those at the farm for, like, two bucks, bruh. Oh god. Oh god, my car's going crazy. Yeah, I'm trying to talk and... That dude just slapped me. But anyway, so I was standing in a line for a half hour just to go in and get my uniform. And it was, like, a five-second activity. And I don't know why it took so long. I mean, there was, like, a hundred people on the team or something. I, had, I yelled a couple times, Hey, everyone get in the line! And there were ladies across the hallway. And this one dude in front of me was like... And I did not want to see what he was looking at. I'm like, bro, you good, man? You, are you looking at something good, bro? He's like... He just says that to me. Literally, with no, no worry. I'm like, bro, you good, man? Uh-huh. I don't even want to announce what he was probably looking at, but I can assure you, you were probably listening. You were, you, you're probably not listening. You're just trying to ignore me or something. If you're ignoring me, then what the? God, I got slapped. Ugh. So anyway, math class. I took a math test. The whole period, I had to show every, I had to show every spot of work on the piece of paper, and in fact, I didn't, because apparently, Mr. Richardson said. Actually, he said you can leave out a few boxes because there's some boxes that you don't have to show you like that you that doesn't require you to show your work. So I I didn't show my work on like half the boxes because half of them I did in my head, which I should have wrote on the paper. And one the the papers the boxes that I did write I just wrote like, for example, not not two plus two, but I just wrote down like one problem like like. But I had to find like like TV's like nine hundred ninety dollars and a fifteen percent off. I just wrote like zero point one five times nine not nine ninety and got the answer. That's why I just because he said what you type in the calculator, you put on the paper. Eh, can't assure the can't assure that's kind of something. Wait, did he? Yeah, that, that's good. Kind of so I took the whole. I don't. I don't know what I got because. Right when I was done with the test, I put my hand on the screen, and when I submitted it, I covered the score because I don't want to know my score instantly. I like to just go in my grade book and just look at it for like from further, because I don't want to know my score instantly. Because if I get like a bad score, I don't want to be like depressed the whole day. Like, uh, no, no, I, I don't have a bad score. Oh no, it's the end of the world. Help me, mommy. Me, daddy, oh my god, my mom's gonna kill me. I got an F. I, I actually don't know what I got. I haven't looked in the grade book yet. I probably should look. I mean, I don't know if Mr. Richardson um, got it in by now, but yeah. Band class. I was I was psyched to do my solo because I was waiting so much freaking time to do my solo. Like, when I, when, right when I went to band class, I asked Miss Lauk, am I going to do my solo today? She said, yeah. She announced the order. I was the last one to do the solo. I was the last one in the class. I was the last person of the day to do the solo. Because I got in there at like 10.19. And the period ends at like 10.24. And I only had five minutes. The song's like four minutes long. It took me like a minute to like introduce myself. Like, hi, I'm Troy. I play the trumpet. Blah, 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 blah. And so, I actually was able to go straight through my solo song in one try. Because, um, the pianist, I mean, I think the piano guy, the piano girl's pretty good. But lunch! I mean, 
lunch was normal. Oh yeah. So um, it, it literally every single lunch, Andrew is always annoying me with his bottle flipping. Literally, when he like he has his packed lunch, but he goes to the lunch line. It pays seventy five cents to get a water, and he technically just drinks half of it and then just flips it. I feel like that's the only thing he uses for water bottles. That was like twenty sixteen, bro. Get your mind got get your mind off of twenty sixteen. This is twenty eighteen. We have like gum watches. Where the heck did I get that from? So a Andrew, he just gets like I said, he just gets a water bottle and just flips it like like no no fuck duh. Literally, I I tell him to stop. He's like okay. A couple of minutes later, he just starts flipping again. This one girl by me that I think is super fucking ugly, Michaela. I mean. She just, uh, she just actually, I was actually with her for like two minutes or something. She takes the water bottle, throws it in the trash can. Andrew goes right to the trash can. And this was actually, this was today, by the way. He just goes to the trash can, picks up the water bottle, and just does more flipping on the table. He does it standing up. And every time he caps it, he looks around like, hey, guys, uh, I capped the water bottle. He's, I feel like he's always trying to get attention. I mean, I, I don't blame him for it. It's, that's who he is. You be who you are. Don't change who you are. But, um, I'm not saying I want Andrew to change. I just want him to, like, like, like notice what he's doing. Like, no, no one, I'm, I always say to him, like, no one really cares. Like, no one else in the lunchroom does random bottle flipping. No one else in the, does random bottle flipping. He's the only one that, he does it standing up. Why not just do it sitting down? If I was Andrew, and I was the one standing up, and I'd be like, maybe, hmm, maybe I shouldn't cap it because capping the bottle makes a lot of noise when it when it lands on the table, landing it or not or not landing. And yeah, so back to Michaela or something. When after she slams it in the trash can, Andrew gets um, the water bottle. I do the exact same thing. I just throw it in the trash can. Andrew just comes to the trash can and Ted takes it right out. And so, way right when Andrew was about to do more flipping, I take the bottle. Michaela goes to the trash can. He's like, Troy, throw it over here. I actually throw it over here. Michaela actually throws it in the trash can. And, and that was the third time. Andrew goes to the trash can for the third time and takes it out. Like, Andrew doesn't want that water bottle to go. I mean, literally, I'm not even joking. There hasn't been, there is, there was not one lunch period where he hasn't done water bottle flipping. I actually had to sit by him because that's my assigned seat. Sometimes I would ask um the lunch, um, Mr. Adkins, um, aka, to sit at the other tables, but I rarely do that because there's no sense in me going to that table because I would have nothing to do there because sometimes the other tables are boring. And pretty much, I I talk to Andrew the whole lunch period as he's flipping bottles. And um, to be honest, I'm actually um, usually when I'm at lunch, I always go on my Chromebook and go to like subscriber counts to YouTubers that are like close to like, what, like another million or something. So yeah, that's basically it. And um, plyometrics, we were doing um, basketball or something like um, you know, like championship basketball. Like 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 if you win a game, you go to the next basketball court. My my captain wasn't here, so we had to replace that person with Ethan Ford. He's an okay basketball player, but the thing is, the whole none of the people, none of them were passing the ball to me. I'm like wide open. They pass it to the to someone who's like being blocked like super bad. I'm wide open, and Ethan is like and and like Adam is like being guarded by like two people. Ethan throws at Adam when when I have no people blocking me. Literally, like, the three people on the other team were blocking Adam from, like, getting the ball or something. I'm the one that's wide open. Ethan just throws it to Adam and not me. No one has passed the ball to me. I barely had gotten the ball because no one passes it to me. And I basically just stood there almost the whole time and not, not, I mean, trying to, like, be like, Ethan, pass it to me, boy. Every time I got the ball, every time I was able to manage the ball, I'm, like, two feet away from the hoop. Ethan tells me to pass it to him when he's, like, in the back like like he when he's at the three point shot, I'm like in the um free throws. I'm like I'm like two feet away from the hoop. Ethan tells me to pass it to him when he's like ten feet away from the hoop. I pass it to him. He sh tries to shoot it. Of course he misses. Like they like I feel like they just don't want me to shoot. They just don't want me to shoot. In a history class, I'm not, I'm not sure if I mentioned history class, but um history class I just I just had to work on a project. I had to. Um, Write an article of um. <coughs> excuse me. Uh, 
I had to write. I'm not gonna hit him. I had to write an article about um what we learned, like like of, of a topic we learned in history for the past whole year, and I actually had struggle with that. I I feel like I've done nothing for a few. I feel like I've done nothing for six months. For six months, I've done nothing. And Miss Torrance said, just write an article, like a, a like a lesson or something you've learned. And I'm like, what? I'm not even joking. I I was like. Uh, did I do nothing for six months? Did I literally just sit on my ass on a on a desk for six for like a whole bunch of class periods for six months doing absolutely nothing? That's why I managed to be like, oh, Black Plague, feudal system. Cause I, we once did a project about the feudal system or something. Or I don't really mention stuff in the past, but I just want to mention stuff that's today. So I explain. I write an article about the feudal system. I write an article about the Black Plague. Um, that can't be good. All right, so I had to I had to, I had to restart the game because I was um a, a a person hit me and uh, apparently uh I was on fire and my car was gonna die. Don't want that happening. So anyway, where was I? Oh yeah, the project. I wrote an article about the black light. We had to explain like how they advertise, how people advertise today about the Middle Ages. Well, it was Middle Ages and the Black Plague or something. I remember, like, I know that, like, it was, like, the 13th and 14th century. Um, I had to write, like, the weather, like, how, like, how the climate was there and, like, extra stuff. And I had to write an article with, with all that following stuff about the feudal system, like, manor, the, um, like their crops or something. I'm not explaining it. I am done it. I'm not, I'm done talking school. Well, I already am talking school, but I already explained science. Maybe, maybe we just did other stuff the whole time and, and I already explained track, so let me just, um, oh yeah, homework help. 11th period on A days, I do, uh, homework. It's, a, it's a, like, basically a study help. It's basically like period, we just do work that we had to get caught up on. I, I had no homework. I, I mean, in fact, I have no homework now. That's why I'm playing a game and talking to you guys at the same time. I had no homework to do. I have absolutely, I had absolutely nothing to do. Zero. So I sat there in homework and like homework help. Well, I, I'm going to call, I'm going to try to call it study hall. Well, I'll try my best, but it's probably not, I'm probably not. I'm, homework. <laughs> God damn. Study hall. I basically just sat there doing nothing. And we actually, there was this bonus thing that we had to do called, that's learning farm. It's basically bonus lessons after we took the language arts SLO for bonus points. I actually did awful on the SLO, but I was like, God damn, I don't want to do the SLO. I mean, the learning farm. I, I, I barely even know what learning farm is, and learning farm is so stressful. It has a game mode, bad quality gaming, because there's this chicken run. Gaming in the literally the graphics are like 1980s. Like what the hell? Learning Farm is not that old. I can't imagine it being that old. Then why? Why? Does why? Why? Does that cover every single class? Did I get lunch? My favorite class. Oh, going home. Oh, Frank is dead. Frank is dead. Why does that sound funny? So yeah, that basically um. It's my first vlog. If you enjoy um, me doing random vlogs and telling me, like, my story and stuff, please let me know by DMing me your phone number. No. 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 I don't need anybody's phone number. I already got a couple. I don't have any girlfriends. I am single. Uh, I'm single. I'm single. But, yeah. Basically, if you enjoy this video, just hit that like button and subscribe. Don't hit me, little girl. Yeah, subscribe if you're new to the channel. If you're if you've been on my channel and you're not subscribed, I don't know why you're not subscribed. But subscribe now, or I will kill you. But that wraps up the first vlog. Have a nice. Now I have to reach out to him. <clears throat> but yeah, <clears throat> that basically ends this under 20 minute vlogs about my day. So uh, if you enjoyed this vlog, please hit the like button. I have stupid eyes. Or, or, Subscribe. I gotta go. I gotta go. I'm gonna try to make this exactly 20 minutes. Well, let me play something really quick. Before it. Bye, have a nice.
Day.